Greetings, I'm Professor K, and in this short video presentation, we're going to see how we go about installing IIS on a Microsoft Windows Server using PowerShell. For this demonstration, I'm using a clean install of Server 2016. To begin this process, let's go to the Start button, and from the Tile menu, select Windows PowerShell. Now we're going to insert the following command, install-windows-feature, space dash name is the switch space we're going to install the web dash server feature and we're going to give that a space and we want to include the management tools so we're going to type in dash include management tools when we're all ready we just hit enter and it starts the installation process and when it gets done we will have installed iis very quickly using just this one command so once the IIS role has completed its installation process, close out the PowerShell console and open up your server manager. And up there at the top, let's go to Tools, and we're going to click on Internet Information Services Manager. Go ahead and open that up. Let's go ahead and make this full screen. And over at the top, you see the name of your server. Go ahead and expand that. And underneath there, you have two containers. One is the Applications Pool, and the other one is the Sites Container. Go ahead and expand your Sites Container. And you'll see that you already have a default website that has been built for you. So that's going to conclude this short video presentation on how we go about installing IIS on a Windows server using PowerShell. So if you have any questions or you have any concerns about any of the information that was covered in this short video presentation, please don't hesitate to reach out and contact your instructor, and I'll see you in my next video.